Hey friends, let's do Right Here Waiting Guitar Lesson by Richard Marks. I'll play the intro, then we'll break it down. Starting on the C chord, we have 3 on the A, 2 on the D, 1st fret on the B, then go to 3rd fret on the E 2 times, and then 1st fret open, 3rd fret on the B. Then we're jumping to the 2nd fret on the A, open D, open G, 3rd fret on the B 2 times, E, open, 1st fret open. So Then we have the open A, 2nd fret D, go to 1st fret on the B two times, 3rd fret on the B, open E, 3rd fret on the D, and then go back to B, 3, 1, open, G, 2, open. Then do the first one again on the C, 2nd one the same. Now this time we're going to play open A, 2nd fret on the D, 1st fret on the B two times, 3rd fret on the B, so same so far, and then E, open, 1st fret, 3rd fret on the D, open E, back to the B string, 3, 1, open, 1, so the last little part there. Finish it off, we're just going open A, 2nd fret D, 2nd fret G, open B, 1st fret B, and do that two times. And that's our intro, then we have our verse. playing a C chord but we're going to add the high G and so third fret on the E string and just a down, down, up, up, down, up and then we're going to an F9 so it's the same as the F chord but keep your little finger on the third fret on the E string and the same pattern down, down, up, up, down, up to a D minor 7 same again down, down, up, up, down, up then go to a G sus 4 do down, down and then just take your first finger off and we've got the G, we're going to mute the A string up, up, down, up. So that last little part, down, down, up, up, down. And just do that through two times and that's your verse. Now let's do the pre-chorus. So we're just starting on an A minor, do two downs. And then do an up on the A sus2, so just let's take your first finger off, up, and then back to A minor, up, down, so down, down, up, up, down. Then just go to F, do the same for one bar, down, down, up, up, down. Back to the A minor, do it the same with the A sus2, down, down, up, up, down, and then F, same again, down, down. And that's our pre-chorus, then we have our chorus, let me do that for you. Before we go on, if you're enjoying the lesson, please like and subscribe and say good day in the comments. We have new songs and lessons every week. You can also make a small donation on my Patreon page and that really helps me out. So let's get back into it. C for a bar, same strumming pattern. Down, down, up, up, down, up. Same on the G. Then we're 
then we're going to do our A minor to our A sus2 like we did in the pre-chorus. So down, down, up on the A sus2, back to A minor, up, down. Then we're going to go to F, we're going to do two downs. We're going to do an up on the F6, so just add your little finger onto the third fret on the B string. Up, back to F, up, and then we're going to this F major 7 sharp 11. So just take, we're going to play the third fret on the D string, second fret on the G, open B, open E, and then down there. So the F, down, down, up. straight back to the C, we do that two times, C again, G, A minor with the A sus2, to our F, down, down, up, up, down, and then we're just going back to our A minor with our A sus2, so you can either pick it like we did in the intro, or you can just strum it the same as the pre-chorus. And that's our chorus there. From there we go back to the verse, back to the pre-chorus, and then back to the chorus. Now the only difference here is we don't add our A minor to the A sus2 at the end. We go straight into the bridge. So let me do that for you. minor 7 for a bar, same strumming pattern. C for a bar. F for two bars. Back to our D minor 7 for a bar. C for a bar. Then we're going to do F for a bar and a half. So we're going to do down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, and then go to G. Up, down, and that's for half a bar there. That's our bridge, then we have our solo, and that's just the chorus again, and we'll do the solo at the end, and it's just leaving out the A minor with the A sus2, the M part again. Then from there, go back to the pre-chorus, the chorus, and then back to the intro to finish off. Now let's have a look at the solo. Starting third fret on the E string two times, then go to the B string, six, five, three, then do the three another two more times, five, five slide to six, and then just five again. So. Then play first fret on the B, second fret on the G two times, and then third fret on the B, open G. And then on the B string, third fret, slide to five, three, one, open, G, two, open. The next part start on the third fret on the E, and then we're playing five on the B, three on the E. Go back two frets to one and three, and then open E, first fret B, and then we're coming up to fourth fret on the G, third fret on the B, and do it two more times. Then come up to 5th fret on the B and the G. Now play it again and we're going to slide up to 6 on the B, 7 on the G. Back to 5 on the B and the G. And then 1st fret B, 2nd fret on the G, 1st fret on the B. 3rd fret on the B. So let me do that little part for you slowly. off we're going to play third fret on the E5 on the B this time we're going to slide the B up one fret to six and the E up two frets to five back to five and three three and one and then come up to five on the G and the B 4G three on the B and back to five and five so that last 
close to the pot. And that's our solo there, and that's all the parts. So thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoyed right here waiting guitar lesson. Don't forget to like and subscribe and hit that notification bell. And if you love your 80s rock, glam, and metal, jump onto my YouTube channel for hundreds more songs. And I'll see you soon.